Need to recover guest files or folders from a Linux virtual machine using the virtual server agent? You're going to need a file recovery enabler for Linux, or FRELL for short. The FRELL is set in the Hypervisor Configuration tab of the Virtualization section of the Command Center. To be able to browse and recover guest files from the Linux virtual machine, you will need a suitable Linux media agent with the file recovery enabler components configured. If there is no available device, there are a number of options available to you. Convault provides a free of charge for an appliance for VMware and OpenStack. Use the template supplied by Convault to create a virtual machine that contains the file recovery enabler. This is deployed as a media agent in restore only mode and does not consume a license. The appliance requires four gigabytes of RAM, four vCPUs and 80 gigabytes of disk that can be thick or thin provisioned. To download the template, log in to cloud.convault.com and then access the store. In the virtualization section, in the OpenStack and VMware folders, file recovery enabler templates are available for each available feature release. Download the template matching your environment. Once downloaded, switch to vCenter and select the option to deploy OVF template. Select the template you downloaded and hit next to proceed. Give the virtual machine a name and select a data center or folder to deploy to. Hit next to proceed. Select a host, cluster or resource pool to use and hit next to proceed. Review the details and proceed to configure the storage. Select the necessary data store to use and choose a disk format. This can be thick or thin provisioned. Hit next to configure the network. Select a destination network to apply to the Frel virtual machine. This network must allow communication with the hypervisor servers and the comserv. Hit next to customize the template. The first section to configure is the IP configuration. Enter the DNS details, gateway, DNS servers, netmask and static IP address or select to use DHCP. Now move on to the client configuration. Select automatic OS updates to automatically apply security updates to the operating system. Add a client group if needed. Enter the fully qualified hostname. This must be resolvable in DNS. Add the short client name and enter a new password for the root user before moving to the ComServe configuration. First, enter the short name of the ComServe followed by the fully qualified ComServe name or IP address. Enter the password for the user configured to allow registration of the FRAL component. This user must have the administrative management and agent management permissions assigned. Enter the username and then configure any firewall configuration if required. You can configure one-way routes in either direction or connection via a proxy on specified ports. Hit next, review the summary and hit finish to deploy the FRAL template. This may take some time to complete. Once complete, ensure the virtual machine is powered on and wait for the boot and configuration to complete. If you are viewing the event viewer in the command center, you will see entries showing the installation of the various components for the Frel virtual machine completing successfully. Once complete, you will see this client listed in the file recovery enabler for Linux field in the Hypervisor Configuration tab. You will now be able to browse for individual files or folders from within the guest operating system of your Linux virtual machine. Select Guest Files as the restore type. Select the files you wish to recover. Hit Restore and your selected files are restored. For more help topics like this, check out kb.convault.com.